10, 9, 8, 7, 6, start, 2, 1, boost ignition, and lift off of the space shuttle Discovery, returning to the space station, paving the way for future missions beyond. Why not realize it? Virtually everything that we do in our day to day lives involves science in one way or another. Our life is really influenced by science in various aspects. There are few daily activities which have scientific basis. A moving fan increases the velocity of air molecules. These air molecules having high kinetic energy can easily vaporize the sweat that we have in our body. So having increased rate of evaporation of sweat from our body, we feel so cool. In common belief, rubber is considered to be more elastic than steel. But it is quite opposite in physics. Do you know how? Every student starts a class with wiping the dust off the decks and benches. There always will be a layer of dust on the bench every morning. Have you ever had a thought in your mind why, why this could happen? Actually, when doors and windows are shut after the school hour, there is no movement of air molecules in and out of the class. So the minute dust particles gain a steady terminal velocity and fall down on the benches making a layer. Whenever we jump up, we are quickly pulled down on the earth, but this doesn't happen on the surface of the moon. On the outer space, the astronauts keep on floating due to the lack of gravity. But on Earth, there is gravity, and acceleration due to gravity of Earth is 9.8 meter per second square, which pulls any object towards the center. You may not realize, but walking of a person involves the physical phenomenon of force, which is described by physics. Whenever we walk, we press on the ground. The ground in turn pushes us back which is the reaction. The reaction force is used in two ways. One, to balance our body, and next, to provide the certain force to move us ahead. You may ask to a soldier to hit a stand target, or should we aim? You'd say, we must always aim above the target. The reason behind this is the motion of the projectile, which is described by physics. A projectile is any body moving under the effect of gravity alone. Whenever we kick a ball with certain initial velocity making an angle with the horizontal, it covers certain horizontal and vertical distance in a parabolic path like that of projectile. Every one of us love to enjoy the time with nature. Our heart lifts up whenever we behold the mesmerizing beauty of green forest and blue legs. Have you ever wondered why do most plants look green? The science behind this is plants have pigments like chlorophyll is a photosynthetic pigment. These pigments absorb red, blue and yellow region of the visible spectrum but they do not have such pigments to absorb the green light. So they reflect green light and we see and enjoy the greenery of plants. Whenever we see it in front of the mirror, we see our image due to the reflection of light. There is lateral inversion in the formation of image. In daily life, we come across pushing and pulling of the loads while doing our work. You might have experienced it's always easier to pull the load than to push it. Physics explains this phenomenon as Whenever we push any load, we apply the force in an inclined direction. In this case, one of the components of the force is added up to the weight, making the load heavier, and it is difficult for the next component of force to move the body ahead. But the phenomenon is different for a pulling case. Whenever we pull a load with sudden inclined force, one of the components of the force acts opposite to the weight making the load lighter and it's easy for the next component 
to move the body ahead. So remember, pulling makes you smarter, not pushing. After having a cool bath or washing, we use towels to wipe our body and face. The towel works on the basis of capillary action as described by physics. The towel is made in such a way that it has fine porous threads. The water travels through the passage of these fine pores from our body and face and dries up our body.